What's going on guys? As most of you already know, my name is Chad, and welcome to Raid My Vault, bro. I believe it's episode 4? I don't know, I have to go check. Something like that though. Today we have some gameplay from Psychotic Kamikaze, I believe. And I'm just going to kind of start the gameplay and talk a little bit about Raid My Vault, bro, in general before we get into the gameplay, because there's a couple things I want to I wanna cover, and if I leave that little thumbnail up, it's probably going to be... You're going to be staring at it for like 5 minutes, so... First off... I'm still taking submissions as always. I don't care if I end up with, you know, a thousand of them. I'll get them all up eventually. That's the whole point of this. I want to involve you guys in, in the whole YouTube process with me. Um, so if you want to submit your video, all you have to do is send me a friend request on Xbox Live. My gamer tag's Angry Spanish Guy. There's no spaces. It's just like my YouTube name. And leave a message. I mean, it, if you don't want to send a voice message, fine. You can send a, you know, a text message or whatever the hell you want to call it. But... Make sure you send a message with what slot the gameplay is in, in your vault. And it can actually be in any of the 24 slots. You know, if you have Elite, you get the upgrade to 24 instead of, what is it, 5 or 8 or whatever the normal number is. Uh, so they fixed that. So you can put it in any number now and I'll be able to see it. Before it had to be in the first 8 or I wasn't able to view it. So go ahead and do that. Uh, as far as the friend requests go, I've told you guys in the past when... Uh, when I get your friend request and I see what slot the game plays in, you know, I accept it, I add the gameplay to my vault, and then I delete you off the friends list, because if I saved everyone on the front my friends list, I, I would run out of space, I wouldn't be able to keep doing this, so I have to remove you, unfortunately. Uh, it's, you know, like I said, it's not that I hate you guys or anything like that, but I need room to keep doing this. Uh, secondly... Like I said, if you don't leave a message, I'm just going to delete your friend request because I don't know that that's what you wanted. You know, I have no way of knowing, uh, you know, what gameplay is yours. And don't just, you know, leave a comment under this video saying what slot it's in because I get so many comments now that YouTube, I don't, I, I don't know how this works, but YouTube only sends certain ones to my inbox. So don't do that because then I have to check your YouTube name and compare it to your gamer tag and... Just leave, do me a favor and leave a message, you know, if you want me to check out your gameplay. And lastly, at least I think this is all that I have to say, is, you know, I have gameplays from this from probably a month and a half ago or whenever I started. I have a lot of these to upload, so be patient. You know, if I haven't uploaded yours right away, that doesn't mean I'm not going to. It just means that, you know, I'm kind of trying to do it on a first-come, first-serve basis. I'm not really watching them all and then deciding which ones are best. I watch them, obviously, to make sure that it's something that you guys would enjoy, you know, good, solid gameplay, but I don't, I'm not putting them in any order, necessarily. I'm trying to do, you know, the older ones first. So, like I said, if you haven't seen your gameplay up yet, be patient. It will be up, I promise. Oh, and lastly, you don't have to have a channel to do this. If you have a YouTube channel, please let me know in the message what it is so that I can, you know, link it in the description and help you guys out a little bit, maybe, you know, give you a little bit of exposure. Uh, but... Like I said, you don't have to have a channel. If you do, though, make sure I know what it is if you want your you know, channel linked. If you forget to let me know, just keep checking back. If I post your gameplay, you know, send me a message saying, hey, I want my channel linked, and I will 100% do it. It's not that I didn't want to do it. I just, like I said, I, I couldn't find your channel or something like that. So, Psycho Kamikaze, if you have a channel, same goes for you. Let me know what it is, and uh, you know I'll link it in the description and the annotation and all that kind of good stuff as well. So anyways, let's get into the gameplay a little bit here. I'm sorry it's running down already, but I needed to cover that stuff, and you know that was the easiest way to do it. So anyways, he's using the ACR with a red dot and silencer. A really great setup, actually. Uh, and he works the map. He plays a lot like I do. He tries to stay on the front lines, meaning... All his teammates are generally behind him, but he doesn't push all the way up into their spawn. He tries to, you know, find some cover and put himself in a position that he's going to win most of the gunfights with the enemies as they're, you know, coming out of their spawn or as they're coming around a corner. So he plays really, really smart here, which I love. The strategy on this map that he used is great. You stay towards the middle of the map in that little courtyard, and generally the in team deathmatch, the teams are going to spawn on either end of the map, and it's really easy to you know flip around and take out the team if they're coming the other direction. He's using it looks like Predator, Reaper, and AC-130. If I run kill streaks, which I haven't done that too often, but I'm going to start to a little bit again. But 
if I had to run kill streaks, those are the ones that I would run, especially in you know a TDM game. I I love those kill streaks; they're amazing. And I don't know if he realized this, but I went back and counted, and he was eh, 19 or 20 kills in a row here at this point. So he was actually really close to a mob. I'm assuming if he realized that, he probably would have uh, not called those kill streaks in, and you know, see if he could have got to the Moab. But I got this gameplay a long time ago. I'm going to go out on a limb and say this was probably from the first week or two of the game, so he may not have even known about the MOAB then. So anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Raid My Vault Bro. So let's get on to the recap page. The video on the left is my MOAB for Dummies Dome Edition. If you guys haven't seen that yet, go ahead and click on it now and check it out. The video on the right is my last Raid My Vault Bro. It is actually an awesome video. It's a five-man juggernaut domination game, so it's not... You know, one of those standard Moab or high kill games. Something a little bit different. If you guys haven't seen that yet, check it out. If you haven't subscribed, click on that yellow subscriber button. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. The links will be in the description below. And as always, guys, I appreciate all the support. I will catch you all later. Peace.